that seat. And speakers, we got two speakers. We got Dr. Jason Evans from Stetson University mm -hmm. in Deland, Florida. He went on a more than decade quest, a detective story, to show that water lettuce is actually native to Florida because the Florida Department of Environmental Protection thought it was an invasive exotic and was trying to eliminate it first through pesticides and then through mechanical removal. But it turns out it's not only native, it uh, was seen by uh, early travelers as early as the 1770s, but its uh, spores have been found in archaeological deposits 10,000 years old. Wow. Now, is that that floating plant uh, yep. that uh, it looks like a lettuce plant yep. uh, that they will sprout off and make their own little uh, root mm -hmm. systems between each other, right? Right. Yeah, I, I'm always fascinated by those. I love those, and depending on the river you, you go to sometimes, you'll find, gosh, I, I hate to put it in acres, but I mean, or you would see them along the edge of the waterways for miles. Mm -hmm. And if I'm not mistaken, manatees eat it, so... I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, obviously, they eat everything else, and uh, that's under that is a, a green lettuce type thing under under the water. So why wouldn't they eat that? Yeah. So he's gonna he's gonna talk about that, and he, he, William William Bartram saw it in the Samani River and the St. John's River back in the 1770s. So you know, amongst other detections.